Have you ever wondered how bread is made? How that warm, fluffy loaf lands on your breakfast table? Well, it's a process of transformation, a little bit of science, and some good old-fashioned elbow grease. First things first, gather your ingredients. Bread, in its simplest form, only requires four ingredients. Flour, water, yeast, and salt. Yes, that's it. These four humble ingredients mingle and dance together to create that delightful loaf we all know and love. The first step is to mix the yeast with warm water. Warm, not hot. Yeast is a living organism, you see, and too much heat can kill it. Once mixed, it's left to sit for about five minutes until it becomes frothy, a clear sign that the yeast is alive and kicking. Next up, combine the flour and salt in a large bowl, making a well in the center. Pour the yeast mixture into this well and begin to combine the ingredients. This can be done with a spoon, or for the more tactile among us, your hands. The goal is to create a shaggy, sticky dough. Now comes the part that requires a bit of muscle. Knead the dough on a floured surface for about 10 minutes. Knead until the dough becomes smooth and elastic. This kneading process develops the gluten in the flour, which gives bread its structure and texture. Once kneaded, the dough is left to rise. This is where the yeast really shows its magic. It feeds on the sugars in the flour, creating carbon dioxide gas and causing the dough to inflate like a balloon. This first rise or proofing usually takes about one to two hours until the dough has doubled in size. After the dough has risen, it's then shaped into a loaf. This shaping not only creates the final form of the bread but also gives the dough a final chance to rise. The shaped loaf is covered and left to proof for another hour or so. Finally, it's time for the oven. The loaf is baked at a high temperature, usually around 450 degrees Fahrenheit. As the bread bakes, the heat causes the remaining gas in the dough to expand, creating that heavenly smell and beautiful golden crust. And there you have it, the transformation from simple ingredients to a warm, comforting loaf of bread. It's a process of patience, a dance of ingredients, and a testament to the simple pleasures of life. So next time you bite into a slice of bread, remember the journey it's been on. From flour and water to a beautiful loaf, it's a little bit of everyday magic.